very long time, Marin Butch Stansinger had been convinced that his eyes were too close together. He'd often looked in the mirror from every conceivable angle. He'd taken a ruler and measured the gap between his eyes. He'd tried to cover parts of his face with his hand, wondering if somehow his other features were causing the trouble. But he didn't really think there was any doubt about it. His eyes were far too close together. In order to solve the problem, Murrenbuch Stansinger had tried wearing wide-brimmed hats to hide his eyes. A prototype pair of spectacles from bent wire to see if these would give the impression that his eyes were further apart than they really were. But he didn't think they did. Some days, Murren was so acutely conscious of his eyes, he was too embarrassed to leave the house. He just sat and moped. Finally, Murren looked at himself in the mirror and said, Marin Butch Stansinger, you can't go on like this. Your eyes probably aren't that close together. And even if they were, he thought, I'm sure nobody has ever noticed. That evening, Marin Butch Stansinger's next door neighbor came round to cut his hair. How do you want it? she asked. Mm, perhaps a fringe, he said. Oh no, Murren, she said. A fringe wouldn't suit you. Your eyes are far too close together.